level up, 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 level up. All this on me so yummy, all this sauce so yummy. No, you won't. Hey, you guys, it's your girl Amber Gonzalez from the channel Amber Gonzalez TV, and today I want to talk to you all about how to make foreign friends. How do I make friends when I travel? This is something that I get all the time. I'm going to upload this video on my Korean channel of how to make Korean friends, etc. But um, on this channel, I am going to talk about how do I make foreign friends when I travel. So guys, this is not rocket science. Like, I get this question a lot. Guys, it is simple. Like, all you have to do is be social. Be social. And what I mean by that is I see a lot of videos on YouTube and a lot of people are saying like, you know, I go here and I just can't make friends. I don't know how to make friends, blah, blah, blah. Well, it's not the people that's not friendly. It's you. <laughs> you have to be social. So everybody always asks me, Amber, you go somewhere, you make friends and blah, blah, blah. You always do this or that. The thing about it is I'm a social person. So when I travel, it's easy for me to accumulate friendships and make friends because guess what? As y'all always see, I'm usually talking to people. I'm friendly with people. People come up to me. I go up to people. If I need help with directions, I'm like, excuse me, sir. Do you know how I can get to blah, blah, blah? Usually they'll tell me, they're like, oh, so where are you from? I'm from here. I'm just visiting. Do you happen to know other places I can visit while I'm here? Boom, you make a friend like that, right? It's not that hard, guys. It's not that hard, seriously. Um, even when I was in like Colombia, I noticed, and I went by myself, I didn't know anybody. This was the first time I went to Colombia. I didn't know anybody there, and I made friends there. People I still talk to till today on WhatsApp. So, literally, what did I do? Like, I just talked to people. The simple thing is, is like, I can be in a supermarket. Something simple as, you know, I'm talking to the store owner. Hey, señor, una pregunta. ¿Dónde puedo ir para bailar salsa? Quiero bailar salsa choque. ¿Dónde está? ¿Dónde puedo ir? Right? Period. Just ask, where can I go to dance salsa? You know, I'm not from around here. Is there any place I could go? Any place you recommend? And usually what happens is people around will hear me saying that. And they're like, oh, I know. Or hey, my friends and I am going. Like, you have to be a social person. And that just goes with the part of being a language learner as well. Like, to be a language learner and to actually be good at languages, you have to be good at talking to people first. You can't be afraid to talk to people and meeting people and just afraid of people like you can't be like that you will not make friends so you're somebody that's visiting let's say i don't know italy right you can't complain i can't make friends in italy because nobody will talk to me or blah 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 you have to talk to people <laughs> that's how i make friends you have to talk to people you can't be afraid or you can't be like oh i should have learned italian by now i've been living in italy for seven years and i still know italian that's because you're not talking to people in Italian. First of all, you're too afraid to make mistakes, which is like the number one thing that keep people from progressing in any language. It's because they're afraid to make mistakes. Now, whatever your reason is, maybe somebody made you feel bad you made a mistake before, or maybe you're just someone that's always doing something perfect, you don't wanna mess up. Whatever your reason is, you have to like put that, bury it, throw it away, basura, right? It doesn't matter. The only way you progress in language is if you practice talking. That's what you have to do. And in order to get better at talking, you have to be better at talking to people. <laughs> you can't be afraid to talk to people. That is my major tip for you all that want to make friends in these countries, these places that you go. You have to be a social person. So like, let's say if you go out to the bar, right? Look cute, yeah, you might get attention from a guy or from whoever, even other females. You need to look approachable right so people are attracted to people that look approachable i remember when i was in colombia this last time i was with a friend and i went to visit her but we were downtown bogota there were nightclubs and casinos around there was a girl that i saw walk by with her boyfriend right and she's from she's from colombia or panama i think she's colombian she's afro-colombiana and 
she said something like, I like your shoes, or something she said to me, and I was like, oh, you know, gracias, by the way, where are y'all going? Like, y'all look cute, we trying to find some clubs, blah, blah, blah. I said all that in Spanish to her, and she's just like, oh, girl, we don't even know where we're going. To. I don't know, like, what are y'all doing? I'm like, girl, I don't know, but let's do something together, right? That was me being friendly with somebody. I didn't know them, and God forbid, like, um, God forbid you're someone that's too afraid to talk to people because, oh, they might kidnap me. Blah, blah, blah. Like, I, God knows, I, that is like the biggest pet peeve of mine. I cannot stand to be with people like that, and I can't stand people that have that arrogant mentality. And what I mean by arrogant is mentality that a lot of people have in the States, that I'm better, you're not, you're just looking to hurt us, and blah, blah, blah. That is not the case. So if I had to have that mentality in Colombia, I would have never made those friends. I would have never been able to exchange WhatsApp with certain people there, right? I have a lawyer friend there that I made, and that was just off of the lady I was staying with. Her friend and I became friends, and we still talk. She's a lawyer. So it's like I naturally just make friends with people, and that's because I'm not afraid to talk to people or smile and ask questions and this is how you build friendships no matter where you are. Not too long ago, and I worked the flight to Montreal, right? In the airport, there was this, this Korean boy. I knew he was Korean. And I spoke to him in Korean. I'm like, oh, something in. I'm Wuxad, I'm in Nina. I was like, are you a Korean man? You know, that's what I asked him in Korean. And he was like, holy cow, like, yeah. And to my surprise, he's super Americanized, but, <laughs> cause he was like, holy cow, yeah. I'm like, oh, snap, blah. Not, not the one I was looking for. I'm looking for someone that can't speak English. <laughs> but long story short, he was just like, wow, like you said that so perfectly. I just kept in Korean. I'm like, actually, you know, 저는 학생입니다. 공부하고 있어요. 한국어를 정말 좋아해요. You know, I just kept talking to him in Korean, and he's just like, this is his accent in English. He's clearly he's born and raised in America. But he was like, if you don't mind, can we exchange cacaos? You know, and we can talk sometime. Like, that's pretty cool that you're learning Korean. And he was so nice. And even now, like, we talk to each other, even though he don't really talk much Korean. But he's so impressed by that, we became friends. So, the whole purpose of this video is, y'all, it ain't rocket science. When y'all ask me how do I make friends, how I make foreign friends, by being social. Now, it's a difference when you're trying to be social and people ain't don't want to talk to you. They not being social with you. When me and my mama was in Paris, I don't mean to bring up bad experiences. <coughs> No pun intended. But when me and my mom was in Paris, I tried being social with people. I'm like, bonjour, excuse me, blah, blah. I didn't speak French, so obviously that's what upset people there. But people just weren't friendly to us. You know, it don't matter. I was being my normal self. Like, hey, girl, blah, blah. Y'all saw in my Paris vlog, I was attracting people naturally, but the people that I attracted wasn't even from Paris. <laughs> it was a Colombian man jumped in my video, and he was talking to me and my mom, and then a lady from Spain. But I don't know what it is about Paris, but I, no matter how nice I was trying to be to people, they weren't buying it. They like, get about my face. So, <laughs> but uh, apart from that, guys, it just really depends on you and how you are. There is not a place in the world where you're going to put Amber Gonzalez and I'm not going to make friends or talk to people and be social. But the bottom line is, you can't walk around like with a poker face. Who's going to want to talk to you? Seriously. Be friendly, be approachable, be, be nice, smile, talk to people. This is how you make friends where you are. So that's how I make friends at least. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed this video. Now I'm gonna do the how to make Korean friends on my Korean channel, which is called Ambi Speaks Korean. So that's it guys, eso es todo. Gracias por ver y nos vemos pronto. Bye.